and some soy sauce. Um, let's see. Maybe some onion powder. I already got minced garlic out. Obviously, I have the egg. So I put some extra virgin olive oil. I'm gonna put the cauliflower medley. It's frozen, so. And we are going to let that unfreeze. It's in this like big chunk. That's cute. I added the soy sauce. It's no longer frozen. I added some onion powder it's garlic. So next step, once I cook a little bit more, I'm gonna add some eggs. We'll see how they make me feel. Sometimes they make me feel sick. Now I'm gonna add some organic eggs. See how that pans out. I'm gonna add another. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna do the two eggs. I'm gonna go wash my hands. I'll be right back. I have cat and dog fur all over me. <laughs> Completed. So, but Becky and I are about to have some tortellini. It's the cheese lovers. It is honestly so good. This is one of Becky's favorite meals. Baby, are you putting marinara or? She usually, not marinara. She usually puts spaghetti sauce or pesto. I always do pesto. And this is my most favorite pest, pesto. And it's the same brand. I just now noticed that. So this is 100 grams as a serving. And this one is 60 grams. So it's actually... This is a fourth of a cup. Sometimes I weigh and sometimes I measure, it depends. A fourth of a cup, 60 G, or this one is a cup, 100 G. So I'm gonna use, I just wanna see, sometimes I like to do this too, like how accurate. I do have a, uh, I've had this for a long time. The tortellini cup or 100 G, which should come out to the same thing, but you know. So the cup came out, Wow, this one is inaccurate. So that cup is actually 146 grams. So I'm going to add that I'm having 146 grams onto Noom. That's about a serving and a half. That is insane. See, that's why sometimes I use cups, sometimes I measure. So for the pesto, I'm actually only doing half of a serving because I do not need a full one at all. So I press tear so it goes back to zero on my scale. So I'm looking for 30 grams, okay? So if I was using this, that's probably how much I'd use. Let's see. 25, I was close, so I get a little more. 30, wow. I did that like perfect. So this little bit of food, which I try not to eat, tiny bits of food for so many calories. Obviously I have to mix it and stuff, but for this tiny bit of food is 559 calories. That's a lot. You guys, this is worth the calories, honey. So I'm about to have me some breakfast of champions here. I'm gonna make me an egg and I might have some carrots and hummus as well. All right, so I'm actually gonna have two. Do you guys like this little individual fan? It's so cute and it's pink. Cause I have a whole pink set. Cute. So for my eggs, I like to put garlic salt. You know what? I'm actually just gonna put everything but the bagel seasoning. Best choice I ever made was buying this. Look how cute. 
so a little breakfast here. Everything but the bagel seasoning. So I have carrots. This is where, this is where I cut my uh, apple. Apple, carrots, buffalo hummus, and two eggs. Yum. This is definitely gonna fill me up. I'm about to go. The reason why I'm vlogging is because I want to try these mashed taters that everyone raves about. <laughs> Let's see if I can find them. Look at our freezer. <laughs> um. See, this freezer is tiny. Excuse my language. Okay, so everyone says that these mashed potatoes are great. A lot of people on Weight Watchers like raves about them. So I'm gonna try them. So this is how they look out of the bag, not gonna lie. Super cute. They're only, you get 10, which I got 12. Shh, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Doesn't matter. You get 10 for a serving for only like 130 calories. Like I'm there for it. So I'm gonna let it do its thing. So microwave it. I said two and a half seconds, but I always do longer because that's just how I am. And then you like stir it and then put it in there again. And then it'll be done. Um, I might add some like seasoning to it, like garlic salt or something. Look at my earrings. I actually really love them, not gonna lie. So I also decided I'm gonna have a garden veggie patty with it. So this is how it looks so far. I have to actually put it back in the microwave after my veggie patty's done. I wanna say for another, I don't know, two minutes because it actually cooked really well. All right, so I'm gonna add a little bit of onion powder. Ooh, okay. Some garlic salt. So I'm not gonna lie, I feel like if I had pepper jack cheese and scallions, which are like green onion, this would be great. So, you know, I'm just gonna cut this up. You guys know, you guys know. So let's do a little taste test together. All right, so we have, why does my hair always look like this? <laughs> So we have some of the mashed haters and the veggie patty. Mmm! Yep, hands down. Next time I'm getting me some pepper jack cheese and some chives, so good.